going to be about five cages that are the best for gerbils and their pros and cons of each. Please bear in mind that these are in order of my opinion, all these cages are great and this isn't to say that there is not equally great cages out there. The minimum cage size is considered to be 5 gallons per gerbil, however I believe the 10 gallons per gerbil is much better as bigger is better. A floor space of 24 inches by 12 inches is the minimum or 28, 288 square inches but again this is just the minimum and bigger is always recommended. At number 5 I have put bin cages with or without a topper. Even though you can make them as large as you want, any little ridges on the plastic can be chewed on by the gerbils. The pros of this is that the size is up to you, there is many different sizes of bins out there that you can buy. You could have it with, with or without the topper, it provides deep digging space and it is fairly cheap normally. The cons are that obviously it could be chewed on. At number 4 is the extra large Pets at Home Gerbilarium. This is pretty spacious with a wire topper and plastic base. It provides a lot of digging space and a level where you can have a wheel, food, water and hanging toys. When I used this for the boys I found it fairly easy to tame them and overall it is a good sturdy cage. The dimensions are 56 height, 70 length and 37cm width. At 3 I have the Living World Green Eco Habitat. This cage is from Zoo Plus. It comes in three different sizes, provides a lot of digging space and it looks nice. I'll put the dimensions of the small, medium and large on the screen now. The pros are that all sizes are brilliant for gerbils. It has wheels so it's easy to act, it's easy to move and the wheels are removable. It's perfect for digging and for climbing toys. The cons are that the ventilation is okay but it's not the best as it just slips in the wood. At two is the aquarium or tank with or without a topper. Aquariums make a brilliant home for gerbils. They provide plenty of digging space, can have a topper attached to it. With a homemade lid they will have plenty of ventilation and tanks come in a variety of sizes. It is best to start with 10 gallons and have 5 extra gallons per gerbil, but I recommend just going 10 gallons per gerbil. So obviously for like 2 gerbils you would have 20 gallons, I recommend a long, and for 3 you would have 30 and etc etc. That's just what I think though. Finally, at number one, I have put the IKEA Detov. This has brilliant digging space and a large floor space with just under a thousand square inches. You can also attach a topper to it or just make a lid. I also like that you could have one digging section and one low bedding section bit for food, water and wheels. I found it very easy to handle the gerbils. The pros of this is that it is inexpensive at £40 new. It's a big cage, it looks tidy, you can have a topper, you can have a topper or you don't have to have a topper. It's good for climbing and hanging toys, but the cons are that it's still a chance of bar chewing. Alike. So thank you so much for watching. I will leave a list of these cages and where you can get them from in the description below. And yeah, so I hope you like this video. Please comment, rate and subscribe.